Five hour energy. So first time I took five hour energy, I was driving from uh, Bonnaroo uh, in Tennessee. Um, it was before I got pulled over by law enforcement for um, not switching lanes uh, when they're stopped emergency vehicle. Um, the emergency vehicles were the police. And uh, I smelled something fishy, didn't argue with the cops, got away, um, and I'm here to tell, it, tell you all about it. So, um, five hour energy uh, claims to give you like five hours of good energy. Um, got a little guy running on there because he's like pumped. He's ready to get after the day, like just destroy it drink this and go running and then like meet some girls and do a lot of homework. So in here, um, something called niacin. Niacin is a, a B vitamin and it's used therapeutically for cholesterol. Um, at these doses in here, um, it's, it doesn't have any therapeutic use, but it is uh, something you need in your diet. Um, and it's part of uh, metabolic pathways, uh, which store and break down energy. You have B6, which is also part of um, metabolic pathways. I think it's a co coenzyme in a metabolic pathway. And you have folic acid. Folic acid is needed by your red blood cells. Uh, in order to function properly and to prevent you from de developing an anemia. And some people do take folic acid uh, then, and it's prescribed by their doctor. They run a blood test and they don't, they see that they don't have enough of it and they take it. And B12, which is another thing that um, is important for metabolic pathways. Uh, it's a coenzyme. Um, any of these things, the niacin, vitamin B6, uh, folic acid or B12 if you're deficient in any of those it could make you tired uh, And then you would be taking that if your doctor found that out uh, You know, they might say okay. Well, you need to take niacin now or you need to eat this or eat that um, I don't think it would give you any kind of like a jolt of energy though, but um, it is important in a diet And some of these things there's a lot of there's a lot of B6 2,000% your recommended daily allowance. And in B12, there's 8,000%. Um, people take people take a lot more than this um, via a shot sometimes if they're, if they're B12 deficient. And B12 deficiencies are actually fairly common. And they come about because people can't absorb them through the diet. So they have to have like a shot. So even if you were B12 deficient, you might not benefit from five hour energy. And there's some sodium probably to, probably for taste or stability of the mixture or something like that. And um, there's the energy blend. So there's some amino acids in here. Um, so the first one's taurine. Now, if you've heard of, uh, you probably all heard of taurine because it's kind of lauded in these uh, energy drinks and it's like taurine does something. I don't think it does anything. Um, it's like food, basically. It's in your food. Um, it, uh, it's needed to build proteins in your body. Um, but I doubt it gives you any kind of like a boost. There's something called glucuronic acid, which is a, a uh, which is needed for building tissue. Malic acid, which is in uh, your T the TCA cycle, which is another metabolic pathway. Uh, tyrosine, which is an amino acid and a precursor to neurotransmitters. And L-phenylalanine, which is also a precursor to neurotransmitters and uh, I believe tyrosine can make phenylalanine and people there's a like one in 15,000 people are cannot have phenylalanine and it has really bad it does really bad things to them 
uh, neurological things makes um, can make people um, lower their cognitive function. It's in Diet Coke. It's in um, aspartame, which is a sweetener that's like a thousand times sweeter than sugar. And um, I try to avoid it. Uh, for uh, I might talk about that in another video. And it's got and there's caffeine, which I love. Um, and thinking about stopping it, but I'm not sure. Uh, caffeine is is uh, an amazing drug. It's probably been around longer than people have. Um, and what it does is it blocks adenosine receptors in your brain and stops drowsiness. And uh, it has a lot of other f effects that used to be used for asthma. Teddy Roosevelt, the uh, the uh, former president, his father would give it to him um, to help with his asthma uh, because that's, they didn't have very many treatments for asthma a long time ago and a lot of people died of it. A lot of people still die of asthma actually. Um, it's a fatal illness for a lot of people um, if it goes untreated. So uh, it has 230 milligrams of caffeine and on the label it says contains caffeine comparable to 12 ounces of the leading premium coffee so I guess that's like Starbucks or um, I don't know what a premium something like you flew in from Hawaii uh, and you you roasted the beans yourself and you crushed them with a little like one of these hand grinder things that's probably what they're they're not talking about folders um, which I love, by the way, and I'm sure 12 ounces of Folgers will get you, like, you want to, like, jog like the guy in the label. So, um, and there's also something in here called Cetacholine. Cetacholine is, uh, uh, in basically acetylcholine, which is a neurotransmitter. You need it, um, to send messages in your body and do all kinds of different things, and, um, it's being used as a, a brain drug, a brain supplement. Um, they put cetylcholine in there and a bunch of other different things to, um, to help cognitive function. Uh, jury's out. I don't know. Jury's not out, so I don't know um, if cetylcholine works. But um, I have a theory, and I'm going to test it in another video. I'm going to try this, and I'm going to try 230 milligrams of caffeine and see if there's any difference. And uh, I could be wrong, maybe I'll feel like totally anecdotal. I think in order to tell if this does anything more than just caffeine, you would need a like, clinical trial. And that's never going to happen because the guy that runs 5-Hour Energy is uh, very budget conscious. So I th he sells like $700 million of this, two bucks at a time. And uh, he has less than 300 employees working for him, um, and he's rich. And so, if you want to be rich, have something just like this, but completely unique. So, I want to thank you guys for listening to uh, Jeff the Pharmacist. And don't go out and buy this just because I was talking about it. It's not the intention of the video. Uh, so, I want to. Thank you guys for listening and please like and subscribe to my channel. Thanks.